So you are welcome to the third edition of PJ Youth Homecoming 2023 Grand Deva. This festival brings about the people and the citizens of PJ home and abroad. Those at home and those at the diaspora to come down, fall together and raise funds to pursue community development. And today we are here to celebrate and raise the funds for the mentioned item which is being to raise funds to build a community library and help with other educational development in the area. So join me and let's go to the program. Yeah. 
communities into the life of the nation to enable them to contribute fully to national progress. In this case, AJ community development is to be based on an organized communal effort designed to improve development, which may include physical and non-physical structures. We want to, accom to accomplish local betterment through willful cooperation and mutual understanding between the members of the community. Sadly, our chiefs and elders who labor to build and develop our beloved PG are not very close as they used to be. The undertone of our elders and for that matter, our beloved chiefs has not been too good for some time now due to chapter's issues. Several attempts have been made to resolve the issues with difficulties. It is against this background that the name of PJ Development Association was changed to PJ Youth for Development Association so that the youth will not be part of the chieftaincy programs. PJ Youth Homecoming Festival with the aim of bringing all citizens of PJ together in love and in unity so that we can rebuild PJ. It is obvious that our mission today is how to restore peace, unity, prosperity of our community beyond the inescapable constraints due to division among the states. This is a clarion call and plead to all the youth of PJ to remain courageous and patriotic to their motherland to effectively play their role as a driving force in building PJ together. We the youth must be fully engaged with determination, professionalism with high sense of sacrifice in restoring unity in PJ. Mr. Chairman, Madam Chairman, it is always true that the future of PJ is in our hands, but we, we need to build it with a very dedicated and com committed spirit so that we can be proud of our home. This is a model of obligation, patriotic awareness, service of the common interest and perseverance of unity among us. Concerning unity, some of us have unfortunately chosen to rally behind, unfortunately chosen to rally behind demons of hatred and division, driven by this unity, often whipped up by nature from some people. This is unfortunate. To speak now, PJ is not having any community library and computer li library. Past three years, nothing like ongoing water project in Sreme, and today the standing tap for people to use. Second edition, we made a number of blocks for teachers, bungalows to build a toji. Third edition, we are building ultra modern computer lab here in Beji Amway. So if we compare the items we have listed above seven years ago when there was no celebration in Beji, Due to chieftaincy issues, fellow brothers and sisters, Togbeo, Mamao, invited guests. If you see the number of youths who joined the float yesterday, yesterday in the night from Kweji, Akome, Jolopita, Jolo, Dodome, back to Kweji, to the extent that some, some people were running to Amway on foot because all cars were full to capacity. They should tell all of us that PJ needs peace for development to continue. Enough is enough. 
The next host will be Avlimi. PJ Avlimi. So we are calling all mini force youths in Avlimi to come on board for another successful festival next year. Preservation of festival, all the youth of PJ must be must do everything possible for celebration to continue. And all must come on board. Please let us all show our love by putting our hands so deep into our pockets. Into our pockets, and I believe strongly that the good Lord will bless you. Thank you and God bless you. Asalu. Asalu.